Hi everyone, this is Dmitry from iRX.com. In this tutorial I will show you how to animate fluid noise with Spatok plugin and colorize text with this gradient. In this sample gradient has steps and shadows. We probably can create this gradient with gradient control, but it will be much easier to use gradient from layer. So first step will be creating a new comp for this gradient. Let's set its size 1000 by 1000. Let's rename it to gradient layer. I'm going to create a few solid layers and fill them with some colors. Next I will add a drop shadow effect. Let's just increase softness to say 130 and copy this shadow to all layers. Ok, our gradient sample is ready. Let's create a new comp with HD size. Let's put our gradient sample inside our new comp and hide it. Then create some text. Let's just type text for this sample. Ok, hide text too. Now create a solid layer. Apply patok effect. Now roll down colorize noise and choose gradient from layer in colorize mode. Then in layer gradient, let's choose our gradient layer. Ok, in base noise tab, let's tweak some parameters. Scale to say 30, complexity to 3. Oh, looks nice. Let's animate it. In first frame, set evolution to 0. In last frame, set evolution to 1 turn. And let's check loop evolution. Ok, looks good. Next scale Y to 1200. And now we can set our text layer here in layer multiply. Ok, we can see the text just cut the gradient with no smooth edges. To fix that we need to add some blur on our text. Select text layer, effects, fast box blur. Set radius to 5 and iteration to 9. Still nothing changes because we need to change here from source to effects and masks. Now we can see our nice bevels here. You can adjust alpha threshold to compensate blue radius. Also you can play with noise gradient offset. Let's activate noise gradient loop to make this animation infinite. You can add some randomness here, play with random amplitude and frequency. Or you can change uh, colorize mode to refraction from layer and play with reflection scale. You can reveal text with this noise. Let's set K to noise brightness here. And move to first frame and set noise brightness to minus 100. And voila. Another sample. I just put here this comp. And use it as a refraction from layer map. Yeah, looks nice. Okay, this is all for this tutorial. See you in next one.